change. A new study shows parents are becoming desensitized to sex and violence in entertainment, and that's having a direct impact on their children. Joining us now with more is Dr. Linda Mental, a licensed family therapist. She also writes a blog on BeliefNet. Thank you so much for joining us, Linda. Great to be here. So first of all, walk us through this study by the Annenberg Public Policy Center. What happened after they showed parents these edgy movies? Well, it, it, it's really interesting because they used just brief um, segments of those movies, and it was only a, a short amount. But what they found after the parents watched those brief segments is that they began to rate the movies as not so problematic in terms of sex and violence. So what you normally would rate as an R rating, they would give a PG-13. And then what happened with that, as a consequence of that, they became much more lenient to what they thought was appropriate for their children to watch. That yeah. is pretty interesting. So what happens to the parents is that they get desensitized. So the more, the, the real takeaway of the study is that the more and more you watch sex and violence in media, the more desensitized you become to that sex and violence. And then that has a, a, a ratings creep, is what mm -hmm. they call it. That is actually my, my next question for you. This ratings creep, you know, when movies that would have been rated R 20 years mm -hmm. ago are now rated PG or PG-13. Yeah, and the rate of violence in, in sexual content in movies has more than tripled since 1985. So if you just look at how much more is there, and then you think how much more we're exposed by the multiple screens that we can watch things on now, then this desensitizing effect is taking place not only um, for the parents, but also for those raters. Definitely. Now, Linda, talk about the psychological implications for the next generation with all the extreme content, and we see so much of that. How does it affect the way that they see and treat other people? So this is the important part for anybody who's watching um, and listening to us, because there are definite effects. The more that kids watch this kind of content, the less empathetic they are towards people in their environment. Second thing is, just like the parents, the kids are getting desensitized to the information as well. And then that translates into more aggression when they're in conflict or they need to problem solve because they've only seen these aggressive models. And so the other one with the sex is that we know, again, from studies, that if children are exposed earlier to sexual content, way before they can handle it and more of it, then they tend to engage in sexual activity at an earlier age. And then there are some studies that do show that watching violence in, on television and the media does translate into some real life uh, violence happening. What's the takeaway for parents as well as adults you know, who are affected by Right, this. so the big thing for parents is first of all, understand how this is impacting your kids, but what do you have to do then as a parent? You have to monitor what you're watching because you are becoming desensitized to that information. So what might have offended you um, a, a number of years ago is probably not offending you, and that is what happens with repeated exposure to this type of material. There's nothing in the Bible that says that this stuff is more right now just because we're more desensitized mm -hmm. to it. We've allowed things to enter into our minds and into our hearts that are not going to help us with the right type of walk with God that we want to have and the holiness that God calls us to. So we really have to take some responsibility here. Very important message for parents and adults. Yes. Thank you so much, Dr. Lundamental. Thanks.